do not lose courage in considering your own imperfections. The fastest way to break the cycle of perfectionism and become a fearless mother is to give up the idea of doing it perfectly, indeed to embrace uncertainty and imperfection. In nature, nothing is perfect and everything is perfect. Trees can be contorted that in weird ways, and they're still beautiful. There is nothing known as perfect. It's only those imperfections which we choose not to see. The day the child realizes that all adults are imperfect. He becomes an adolescent. The day he forgives them, he becomes an adult. The day he forgives himself, he becomes wise. Perfection itself is imperfection. To sit in judgment of those things which you perceive to be wrong or imperfect is to be one more person who is part of judgment, evil or imperfection. Nothing we see or hear is perfect but right. There in the imperfection is perfect reality. Without imperfection, you or I would not exist. Being happy doesn't mean that everything is perfect. It means that you've decided to look beyond the imperfections Imperfection is in some sort essential to all that we know in life. Imperfection means perfection hid. Have no fear of perfection. You'll never reach it. My imperfections and failures are as much a blessing from God as my successes and my talents, and I lay them both at His feet. Perhaps it is our imperfections that make us so perfect for one another. I know why families were created with all their imperfections. They humanize you. They are made to make you forget yourself occasionally. So let the beautiful balance of life is not destroyed. Life is not perfect. It never will be you just have to make the very best of it and you have to open your heart to what the world can show you, and sometimes it's terrifying, and sometimes it's incredibly beautiful, and I'll take both. Persuade thyself that imperfection and inconvenience are the natural lot of mortals, 
and there will be no room for discontent, neither for despair. No one thing does human life more need than a kind consideration of the faults of others. Everyone sins, everyone needs forbearance, our own imperfections should teach us to be merciful. If you look closely at a tree, you'll notice its knots and dead branches, just like our bodies. What we learn is that beauty and imperfection go together wonderfully. My teacher once told me, no one is perfect. That is why pencils have erasers. We're all imperfect, and life is simply a perpetual, an ending struggle against those imperfections. Even imperfection itself may have its ideal or perfect state. All men have their frailties, and whoever looks for a friend without imperfections will never find what he seeks. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel Quotes Cam for more exciting content like this.